Hi, I'm Kyle Weber, turf sales rep at Huron Tractor in Mitchell. Welcome to our showroom. Today we're going to be going over some of the key similarities and differences between our 1023E and our 1025R. To start, I thought we'd go over some of the, the differences between the model numbers um, and, and understanding what means what. So with our 1023E, um, the 1 stands for the series of tractor, 23 represents the horsepower, and the E represents the trim level. The same thing on our 1025R, a 1 series represents the series of tractor, and 25 horsepower, and the R trim level. Some of the key similarities between the two, um, both tractors come with our three-cylinder Yanmar liquid-cooled diesel engines, uh, twin-touch pedals for the hydrostatic transmission, have power steering, uh, mid-PTO, and a Category 1 three-point hitch. Each tractor is also compatible with our AutoConnect mower decks, either in 54 or 60 inch. Uh, both tractors are also compatible with our 120R quick park loaders. As well, you can put a front quick hitch on for uh, front snow blower or sweeper or blade. Both come standard with dual mid hydraulic SCVs for loader work or other hydraulic front implements. Uh, both tractors come with three options of tires, either our radial tire, our R3 turf tire, or our R4 industrial tire. Now we're going to be going over some of the key differences between the two. Um, starting off, our 1023E, like I said, has 23 horsepower and 14 and a half PTO horsepower, while our 1025R has 25 engine horsepower and 18 PTO horsepower. And when you step up into the 1025R, it comes standard with tilt steering as well as cruise control. And it also comes with um, our fender lights here, which come standard from factory. Uh, the 1025R comes with this nice two-piece deluxe seat with armrests. It's also got the nice John Deere stitched emblem in here. While the 1023E is more of a one-piece seat, it's a, it's a bit more basic. There's a major difference in our three-point hitch as well, with the 1025R giving more operator control with a positional three-point hitch as well as locking mechanism for much more precise depth. Another major difference between the 1025R and the 1023E is that the 1025R can come standard from factory with our heated Mauser cab or our 260B backhoe. If you're looking for a great versatile subcompact tractor, then the 1023E might be your best fit. But if you're looking for a few more features and those upgraded seat, positional three-point hitch and tilt steering and a bit more horsepower, then the 1025R would probably suit your needs best. Hopefully this video was helpful and informative. For any more questions, be sure to contact your local Huron tractor dealer and one of our sales reps would be happy to help you out.